I get a lot of people asking me how we were blessed to walk away from corporate America in our early 30s. Well, listen, I don't want to keep that a secret. I want to share it with the world. And so maybe you're listening to this podcast and you're trying to figure out how do I even get started on my journey of entrepreneurship and getting to a level of freedom? Well, text the word freedom to 737-777-9909. Enter your information in. And we look forward to sharing some information with you, a proven system with smart overhead, right? That you can do part-time spare time right from the comfort of your home and have amazing mentors, coaches, and a community of entrepreneurs who are willing to support you and help you on your journey to freedom. Welcome to Code Freedom. I'm your host, Eddie Bales. Have you ever felt stuck? Have you ever felt like there's got to be more to life than the reality that you see every day? Tune in weekly, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays as we crack the codes to freedom in every area of your life. Welcome to Code Freedom. This is your host, Eddie Bales, and this is episode 212. And today, we're just going to talk about the dream. Because we all have a dream, we all have goals and things that we want to accomplish, but how bad do you really want it? I mean, do you kind of want it a little bit, or do you really want it so bad that you're willing to make the sacrifices, that you're willing to be inconvenienced, that you're willing to have the discipline to do things that you don't want to do, so that in the end, you can do the things that you love to do, right? And even when you do the things you love to do, you're always going to have to do some things that you don't want to do, right? Are you willing to live like no one else right now so that later on you can live like no one else, right? Because there's such a small percentage of people who actually go after that. Now, I'm not saying that you got to be like rich or like a billionaire or anything like that, but if you really want freedom, it's still a minority because the average person does not have the freedom that they desire, right? The average person um, is really in a situation where they are bonded in, in, in bondage in several areas of their lives. And so the whole goal of this podcast is to help you get to that place of freedom. And so I bring guest speakers on and I share a lot of things that I've learned and that I'm learning because guess what? Um, I haven't arrived. Um, I, I, I've, I've been blessed to have some success, but again, by no means have I arrived or have I made it, right? Because the journey must continue. The journey will continue to go on. The, the journey will continue to evolve because uh, we all have new levels that God, I think, wants to, t- I believe God wants to take us. We have We have new things that we need to do in the earth, purposes that we need to fulfill. And, and so, the, the whole point that I'm making is just that freedom is not free. Freedom takes work. Freedom takes sacrifice. Freedom takes doing what most people are not doing and doing it long enough to see the results because you don't always see the results right away. You you start to see it. Hey, what if it took you five years to get to your place of freedom? Hey, what if it took you 10 years? Will you still keep going or will you, or will you eventually give up on it and say, you know what? Freedom isn't for me. I'm just going to go back to living the the normal average life uh, that I was living, right? Versus taking risks, right? Versus being stretched, versus being in pain, versus, you know, all those different things that it's going to take. I just don't want you to think that free, even though it looks good, it's not easy. And even when you get to a place of freedom, I'll, I'll, I don't hear a lot of people talk about this, but I would venture to say that you still got to work at it to maintain that level of freedom. Because once you have success, uh, something is always looking to take it away from you. It's it's just like the, the grass and the grass and the weeds. The weeds are always coming. So you have the good grass, but the weeds are always coming to dominate the garden. And that's indicative of so many different areas. That's, that's indicative of our thought our thought life, right? The negative thoughts always want to uh, overtake the positive thoughts. The, the the weeds always want to take the garden. It's just the way it is, right? Uh, in the words of Jim Rohn. So, <laughs> so we have to understand that um, it's going to be. 
every episode we talk about stretching ourselves and growing ourselves and becoming better. And I get it. You're busy. You're on the go. You don't always have time to stop and maybe read a book. Well, listen, I got the perfect thing for you. You're probably familiar with Audible. Audible is an audiobook service from Amazon, and they offer the world's biggest selection of books. I'm talking any book that I've recommended, and I've recommended a lot. You can get that book, and you can listen to it on the go while you're in the car. Why not turn your car into Drive Time University? Uh, and for just for listening to this podcast, you can get your first 30 days free on us. So go to audibletrial.com forward slash code freedom. That's audibletrial.com forward slash code freedom and we'll also put that in the show notes be a process it's going to be a journey it's going to be some work and then some more work and it's going to be exciting because when you get to that place you'll be able to thank yourself that you didn't quit thank yourself that you didn't stop and i promise you even your family will thank you because they'll get a chance to live a life off of your sweat equity just because you kept going, right? They'll be able to do things that the average person will not be able to do, but you'll be able to put them in that position to be able to do it. So look, I just want you to know it's tough, right? It's hard. It's not easy. If it was easy, everybody would be doing it. Everybody would be living it. But the reality is it takes work, right? Even for me doing this podcast and you know, all the social media content that I put out and and then working my day to day business. Right. And 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 so and all the other things that go with that, making sure you exercise, making sure you eat right. Life is hard. Right. Life is work. And so I don't want you to just think just because you see people post the Instagram pictures uh, or the, the video of the vacation that life is always a vacation. That's not the case. Right. Um people typically show on social media what they want you to see but there's a whole world there's a whole life that maybe you don't see uh the grind that goes into being able to live that lifestyle or being able to uh accomplish some of the things that people have accomplished so um this is just a short podcast today but i just wanted to remind us that it's a grind and now don't get me wrong i'm not saying you have to grind all the time that i'm not saying that you have to grind to a point where it's like you start having anxiety and you start, um, you know, you start getting to a place where it's not fun anymore. Keep it fun, right? Make sure that you take those mental breaks, take those vacations, do the things that you got to do to to get some rest, right? That's important, right? And, and sometimes I forget to do that myself. So <laughs> I'm talking to myself right now. Rest is important. But don't misunderstand me. There's still a grind that has to happen in order for you to achieve that level of freedom that you deserve to have because you really do deserve it. You deserve to not have to worry about money. You deserve to be able to take your family on nice vacations so they can see things that they never saw before. You really deserve that. You deserve to not have to be at the nine to five, but to be able to be living your dream. You want to write books, write books. You want to sing, sing. You want to be a comedian, be a comedian and not have to worry about the finances. I want you to live that life, the life that you're supposed to live and not the life that you have to live. Um, you know, I think about the movie of the in- Incredibles uh, where the guy is um, told that he can't be a superhero anymore. So he's b- forced to basically work a job. And I think he ends up working at the IRS <laughs> of all places. Right. And, um, you know, he's just like into this mundane role in an office. Um, and, and he doesn't like it. It's just, it, he's, his, his, his passion has been stripped from him. And, and the whole point, I don't even know his name, the character's name, but it's the Incredibles. But the whole point that I'm making is that I, I just, that scene is kind of embedded in my head because I refuse for that life to be mine. And I also refuse for the people who are connected to me to have that life if they want something greater, if they want something more. And that's my passion is to make sure you get that life because it's it's your birthright. It's 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 destined for you. It's waiting for you, but it's on the other side of the work. It's on the other side of the sacrifices, the sweat and the tears, the pain. Right? You can't have the success without the pain. You can't have the, the muscles without some kind of pain. Right. So anyway, I hope you guys got some value from this episode. This is episode 212 
of the Code Freedom Podcast. Take care, take charge, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for tuning in. Appreciate you guys for listening. Um, Definitely feel free to take a screenshot of this episode. Tag me in it on Instagram uh, or Facebook or wherever you find me on social media. I would love to give you a shout out. Hey, you might even get a prize. Who knows? But uh, excited that you had a chance to take a listen. I hope you got a lot of value. And uh, definitely feel free to uh, give us five stars as well as a review. Uh, Show us some love and we appreciate you. God bless you all and see you all over the top.